Michael Mead has spent the past seven years of his life battling prostate cancer. It is what it is, and you, you know, you can't run from it. He tried radiation, chemotherapy, and even hormone blockers, but nothing seemed to work. So the cancer is just kind of armoring up, and there's not a lot of uh, effective treatments out there. Uh, for me at, the, at this particular point in time. Prostate cancer cells can inhibit or invade the body's own immune processes. This makes it easy for cancer cells to grow and spread largely unchecked. I have two spots on my lower left kidney that are in the lymph nodes uh, where the cancer is, is. It shows up on CAT scans. And then uh, the next step is that it would start attacking the, the bones because that's where it goes. That's why doctors believe Michael may be a good candidate for a new treatment called Provenge. It actually uses a patient's own immune system to help keep cancer cells at bay. Provenge is the first prostate cancer therapy approved by the Food and Drug Administration that uses a patient's own immune cells. And this is where Florida's blood centers comes into play. Nurses at Florida's blood centers extract Mead's white blood cells via a process known as leukapheresis. Those cells are then sent to a Dendrion manufacturing plant where they're combined with a protein that's found in most prostate cancers linked to an immune stimulating agent. The combination of the patient's immune cells and this protein makes up the active component of the patient's own dose of Provenge. It opens up the area of personalized medicine where you can get the right drug to the right individual to treat the right condition. And so instead of receiving the chemotherapy that cures the cancer but wipes out the bone marrow and causes many side effects, this is much more directed. Mead's Provenge enhanced cells are infused back into his body within about 72 hours of extraction. He'll repeat the entire process a total of three times over a six-week period. The key is that it will stabilize the disease. It, it, um, I'm not going to get worse, and so hopefully it, 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 it'll stabilize me for a while. It'll buy me time, and you never know what else is coming down the pike. As awareness increases among physicians and patients for these types of treatments, personalized medicine therapies will only increase. Mead's Provenge enhanced cells are infused back into his body within about 72 hours of extraction. He'll repeat the entire process a total of three times over a six-week period. Florida's Blood Centers currently has two sites that are ready to accept Provenge patients and two more sites are on tap. It's, it's cutting edge medical technology, medical science. And it's interesting because we get to actually see the patient in these situations. Um, our, our main um, objective and main business is to supply blood to our community and to our community hospitals. And while we really enjoy that, it's also nice now to get to be more directly involved with the patient and um, directly involved with their treatment and seeing things progress. As for Dendrion, they are working on this type of approach to treat other forms of cancer. And that gives hope to patients like Mead who have run out of options. My attitude is, you know, it may, it may win, but I ain't going down without a fight. I'm Nancy Gay for Florida's Blood Centers, where local heroes are saving lives.